Holy sh**! Oh my god, I can. Hello, welcome to another YouTube video. Um, I'm really bad at these things. I don't make videos, so it's weird. So, hello. Um, <laughs> I'm going to be transforming into a K-pop star, but like we don't really have the means to do that. Like we don't really have the clothes or the makeup or the hairstylists. So we're gonna do a low budget transformation But the main part in this video today is I'm gonna be trying on the clip-on bangs That I got in the mail from one of my Twitch supporters slash moderators So thank you very much sad boy, thank you for the bangs The first thing we're doing is putting on primer Wait, why do I say we're like everyone's here? Can I- I'm just gonna talk in first person because I don't want to involve people in this That's so much so I have a small mirror in front of me and I hate this mirror because it's like, it's cracked and stuff. So this is gonna help not make my face as shiny. I have a color correcting palette. It looks like this and it's supposed to neutralize colors on my face. I don't know what I'm doing. So this is gonna be so fun. I've been listening to a lot of K-pop lately, but I only know like six songs out of like all the songs in the world. Green counteracts redness. I know that, so purple is for bags? I guess we'll find out. <laughs> Frankenstein tutorial. I think I'm gonna do foundation because we just really need to cover our face right now. So right now I'm using the Rimmel foundation. I don't even know if it matches my skin anymore because I've, I haven't left my, I left my house today, but I just never leave my house. I don't, I just, <laughs> it's been 10 minutes, help me. I use a sponge that's kind of damp. And this is this is this is what I see. Okay, I don't think this is right. Do you hear how loud this is? This is like ASMR gone wrong. I don't think the sponge spreads evenly. Like I used to use a beauty blender, but it completely um I I used it too much and it, I just had to throw it out because it was getting old. So this is the first time I'm using a knockoff and I don't know if I like it. I'm gonna pump it onto the sponge and I just I don't really like doing that because I feel like it it just absorbs all the product and we're poor. So, okay, I'm gonna try it again because I don't think... Okay, I think it's better now. Okay, I think it's actually better. I don't even think this foundation matches me. I look gray. I used to wear this foundation every day before COVID and I'm trying to, I'm kind of questioning like, am I good? Is it just the lighting? I feel like it's not just the lighting. Like I'm looking into the mirror and in my camera and I'm like, girl, you kind of look a little... I look like I'm dead, especially with the eyes. Should I just delete this whole video? I'm not gonna film this again, you know that. I actually thought I was gonna be good. I don't know why I ever think this. I'm always like, oh my god, this is gonna be such a professional tutorial and like it's gonna look great. And then I'm like, I never do anything right. Oh my god, that's too much foundation. Oh my god, oh my god, okay, wait. Cause blend it down I know people blend it all the way down to their necks But like I don't do that because I feel like it smudges on my clothes And we're just not trying to like do more laundry than we have to So I just kind of do it to my jawline And hope that no one gives a crap Oh my god did I ever tell you guys so My first makeup tutorial which was never edited It's just raw footage Was when I was 15 years old And I swear to god I did better makeup when I was 15 than now I'm like 27 Okay, I feel like the bags, it was purple, right? Wait, why would it be purple? I feel like purple would make it more baggy. God, got my concealer here. So I'm just gonna cover up the acne scars and the bags underneath my eyes. I don't even know if this color matches. Oh, that does not match my face. Oh my God. It's like orange. Guys, I don't think I'm a makeup guru. I actually have a concealer that is meant for underneath the eyes and what you're supposed to do is you're supposed to twist it and you're supposed to... I don't know, I'm supposed to poke my eyes out How does this look? Oh I used to be a bit more tan but once again I stopped leaving my house so now we're kind of paler but this is just a face powder and I'm just gonna pat my skin because I have oily face and we need to stop that. How's your life been, guys? How's COVID treating you? You wildin' or you not wildin' out? 
I kind of started watching videos again when I was 19 on makeup. I just never really got into the beauty community for a while just because you know how you have hobbies and stuff? I just feel like I grew out of beauty. Do you guys talk to yourselves? I feel like I do that a lot. I just, I just do it because like there's really nothing else. <laughs> When you lonely, you lonely. I should have did a Q&A, right? I could have been like, hey guys, ask me questions and I'll answer it because I have nothing to talk about and it's one hour of me poking myself in the eyes. I almost threw this mirror out one day. I had it ever since I was a, a kid. I think my friend gave it to me. I don't know why she gave me this mirror, but I was like, true. Like, it's free, right? So any, I used to be that person slash still is who's like, Anytime anything is free, I'm just like, yo. And then I think my sister took it out of the trash. I'm not sure if it was actually in the trash already, but I was definitely ready to give it away or something. Somehow it's back in my hands and I don't even remember how, but this is the cutest thing. And it's actually the perfect mirror to like look close into your face. And I'm just glad I never threw it out because it's an amazing, amazing thing. What should this video be called? K-pop tutorial gone wrong? K-pop makeup gone wrong, the opposite makeover, the make under. No matter how, how this goes, guys, we're committed. We're already 29 minutes in, so how much more can go wrong? I've completely, I'm such a jinx. Like every time I say something like, oh yeah, we're winning, like we're playing a video game or something, or something happens and then I'm like, oh my God, we're doing so good. Completely like lose like right after everything goes downhill like i've had so many instances where it's like that so everyone's just kind of just told me never to talk again which i understand the biggest thing i've seen with like the difference between korean makeup and i guess western makeup is they put the little bag under their eyes which i think could go completely wrong just because i already have huge bags so i feel like this is gonna make it worse and guys if this goes wrong just know that i just tried is this how it's supposed to look? Oh my god, I look worse. I'm not- oh! I just dropped my makeup all over my pants. This is a clown makeup tutorial officially. I was gonna be like, yeah, we're gonna take some hot IG photos, hot by the way. And we're gonna be popping off. Like, look at my face. We can save this. It's just the lighting, it's not- the makeup is fine, it's the lighting that's bad. Guys, I don't even know I'm scared. I'm actually scared. I'm scared of makeup, by the way. I'm scared that my pants have all these stains on it and people are like, why? I need help. I need help. I need help. <laughs> my new ringtone. I probably can't talk when I do this, guys, because I will actually go to the hospital. Does I, does I look good? <gasps> almost lost my eye <laughs> okay i'm not talking guys i think i'm blind i don't wear eyeliner ever like even when i used to wear makeup every day i never wore eyeliner because i don't know how to do it and i feel like my eyes are like super small so if i do like one line or two thick it will, my eyes completely gone we don't really know what we're doing but we're doing it that's like my whole life like i don't know what i'm doing but i'm here i'm questioning my existence today Sorry if like the angles are changing, I just... Apparently I love to kick the camera. Okay, so to curl your eyelashes... <sighs> Wait, I'm so bad at this. I feel like I have no eyelashes and when I do curl them, it just hurts my eyes. Cause I'm essentially curling nothing but my skin. Should I even do my eyebrows? My eyebrows are just another... It's just a lost cause, like I... I've always had issues with my eyebrows. They've just always been super uneven and fuzzy. Cause I know the whole thing with Korean brows is to go straight, but I can't go straight when one of my eyebrows is permanently surprised. Does no one have like, do you guys have a surprised eyebrow? Cause I, I sometimes feel like I'm the only one. The mascara is done. I feel like it kind of made the eye bags look less bad. Like I don't think I can do the bags or I've done them wrong. It doesn't look as bad with the mascara. It kind of brings it all together. Like it's supposed to be like that. I don't know where my brow pencil went. I'm not even gonna lie. Like I used to have one. I might've used it all and like I threw it out or something. I feel like K-Beauty is supposed to be like soft and delicate and natural. I I feel like I'm low-key doing like drag queen makeup not a, not like i'm against drag queen makeup or anything but this is not the makeup we're trying to do but somehow i've just achieved this look but like like terribly oh my god 
I'm like ashamed of myself. They make it look so easy. Like I was watching this girl do a tutorial because I was like trying to learn how to do it. And she's just like, yeah. Just like a little bit of this and a little bit of that. And she looks so freaking gorgeous. And I'm just like, help a sister out. <laughs> help me, please. I have a little bit of clear gel. I think this is this might save the day. I say that and I just jinxed myself. So it's just a little bit of gel to... I don't know what this does. I think it makes your eyebrows stay in place. My eyebrows like so thick now, thick with tensies. I'm gonna take the fan brush and fan off any of the excess that I have. I have so many stains underneath my eyes. I just realized. Okay, so this is just all the excess fallout, loose powders, things that, such as eyelashes that have died in the process of this makeup tutorial slash transformation, whatever you wanna call it. We're gonna fan off the, the remains. Hey. To be honest, I don't even think they really wear blush. Like if they do, it's really light. So I'm just gonna be wearing like a highlighter brush. Brush, by the way, the blush. And I think they, they wear it like more in the middle of their cheek. I think my eyelash just fell in my eye. I'm in pain. I don't think they wear bronzer. But like, I think I'm just gonna wear it because I'm here. <laughs> we might as well go all the way. Okay, so just a little bit. I'm gonna take an angled brush. And just do a little bit of like that and a little bit on the forehead to make our forehead less receding i don't really do highlight um like i feel like i'm already shiny so we don't need to go there i love this lipstick and i'm pretty sure it is expired because i've had it for several years how do i ombre that though One hour later. The makeup is done. Uh, I never part my hair in the middle because this is how I look. <laughs> so, <laughs> that's a fun fact. There was a, why'd you part your hair in the middle? I'd be like, because look at how it is. We're doing bangs now. I know a lot of you guys, I'm like, I wanna see how you look with bangs. Like, do you look better? I can guarantee you I don't. But we're gonna, ho, ho, ho. Okay, hello, you good? Earthquake, sorry. We're supposed to apparently part the hair like an inch from the forehead. Like, I don't know, like this is just what I saw. Like we have to leave like this much out. Guys, the grudge, you just have to clip it in. Oh my God. Guys, okay, and then I have to like me i'm trapped okay this is how i look with bangs now we're all happy it doesn't look fake at all but hello okay wait i just need a there's so much hair on my face i want to shave my head right now the mirror is just so close to my face that i just can't tell where where i am so with this hair you can actually trim it but i just too lazy to do anything with it so i just left it like this is how it came in the box so i just kind of left it and was like vibing with it but you can do whatever you want so if you want only like that if you want it like that you can do whatever you want girl so i choose in like that okay i kind of look like a mess does it look super fake it does right it kind of only goes one direction too i'm pretty sure this hair's fake i said it was real human hair but i really it feels like plastic what if i cover i think i'm supposed to do that like, is that what I'm supposed to do? Guys, I don't do hair. Like, me doing hair is me tying my hair up to wash my face. Do I look good with bangs, guys? Would you, um, talk to me? No? Okay, cool. I get it. I get that. I would actually run. I have dandruff coming out. Let's just cover that up. Bye, dandy. I have white hair coming. There's white hair in the bangs, guys. Like, even my hair that's fake is stressed. The piece de resistance. I'm putting on this chain. Like, I don't have, like, really outstanding jewelry, so this is just the best I can do. <laughs> I added the necklace because I feel like we really needed that. So this is the K-pop. Should I wear a choker? No. I'm just, I'm already suffocating. I added a little clip because I know barrettes are very in. Um, the hair, 
I feel like my face got rounder. I'm not even sure if I'm in the frame. Am I in, why do I look like I'm 5'1", as if I'm not? The hair, it's just, it changes every every few seconds. You know, it can be like hair, and then one day you're like, hey, what's up? I'm just gonna have one huge bang in front of my face. I just don't know how to control these bangs. I think that's what's bothering me a little bit, because the bangs are just kind of going in their own they just doing whatever they want and you know i have control problems i know this part looks really fake and you can just tell that it's not my hair because the top is just completely like wow but if you don't look at the top of my head then you would never know i'm not even gonna try to style my hair i know you can do like little space buns and you can do waves i i i, I can't like i'm just beyond myself right now i feel like i've ascended into another realm at this point it's just I've just completely been out of my comfort zone today. So, I hope you guys enjoyed the look. What do you guys think? I will say that now that I'm kind of like, cause I feel like the lighting that I was filming with was a little bit over my, like it, it was facing down. So it just made the bags look way worse. But now that I'm farther away, I don't think the bags look that bad. I will say that, <coughs> I will say, <coughs> <laughs> this eye wasn't drawn the same as this eye i don't know which one is the correct way i feel like this one looks a little bit more subtle which is what i like and this one was a little bit more like yo let's draw this because i just feel like the lighting in my room was just terrible so they do look a lot better like once you put the eyeliner on and the and you do your lash like once you do your whole face the bags don't look that bad and with, you, with the hair, I feel like the hair kind of matches. Like, it kind of is like the whole, like, ooh-woo. Ooh-woo look. So, I think it, I dig it. You know, I dig it. I got my MJ sweater. I have my swaggy chain. And I have my Harlem shirt. So, what more can you really ask for at this point, right? And my pants, which are stained. And I don't even know why I changed my pants because you can never see them. So there's really no point. So, uh, so yeah. Uh, okay, what time is it? I don't even know what time it is, guys. I feel like I've been, okay, I've been filming for one and a half hours. So future me, congrats for editing this. You deserve a cookie or, you know, probably more than that. But I hope you guys enjoy this makeover look, you know, we out here. Make sure to subscribe, subscribe, like the video, comment. I hope you guys have a wonderful day. And I feel like all YouTubers have a saying, like before they go, they, they say something, right? So I'm trying to like think about what I should say. I should have probably said, hey, Monk Crew in the beginning, but I forgot. So there's that. I hope you guys continue to do what you love. You know, always continue to do things that motivate you to be a better person. So always continue. Press the continue button. Is there a continue button? I don't know. But, you know, press that if there is. So I'll see you guys. And all the best. I love you. And bye.